I spent 13 hours farming for the beige dress in Dress to Impress and I couldn't afford anything else. Just 13 hours straight of farming in prone VIP servers for a virtual Moogler. Yeah. I don't even know how to feel about the game adding currency and farmable items just yet. But I'll talk more about that later on. First, I want to show you the clips of me farming the last 1,000 tickets I needed. Let's see if you guys can decipher it. I have been farming currency in this game for like 10 hours and I'm not even joking and I'm up to 4,159 I don't know what the currency is called I'm, I'm so close I I'm almost there 5,000 I also don't own these yet so it's gonna be 6,000 actually it, it, I need 6,000 you know, if there's any benefit to me playing for this many hours in a row, it's that I'm getting a lot of stars. 42 stars, 65 of the currency that time. But 4,400 now. It's getting late. It's 11 o'clock at night. I want to finish this today. I want to finish this. Yeah, 8,585. I'm slowly, slowly working my way towards Runway Diva. So I've actually gone up 1,500 or so today. Slowly getting closer. Another 60 from that. I'm probably too late to run along here. Yeah, the f oh, I see them at the end there. I see them at the end there. Pro servers and VIP servers. The speedies are going to get there before you, especially if they've got that run speed up. They just hop over like five jumps at a time and now at the end got all the gold tickets to leave us with the crumbs <laughs> i'm so tired guys i've been playing all day and i saw this random person still have the east address now i've looked all the way around here i've not seen a single person wear it all day where could it be the bunny ears you click on the torso the east address is still here it should be permanent that's so sneaky that's so sneaky. Slay. Another 60, another 30. I'll take it. I got 35. I am 95 away. It's so, it's so close. 15 more. Do you see that? 15, 15 more. I could get a gold ticket to spawn right now and I, and I would, I'll, I'll be at the number I need. Just one more game. Just one more game. Just one more game. Guys, I'm at 5,000. I can buy it. I can buy it. Beige dress. Oh my god. <gasps> this is what I farmed all day for. Look at this. Did you think that you was going to see this dress when I first bought it? on a smurf of all things yeah yeah so yeah i advise breaking the farming up over multiple days because you might just lose it no matter how much you love this game i do like that the farmable items give you another purpose to level up but i also think that the dress itself is a bit expensive you can buy the full madoka set quickly and fairly cheaply so in comparison it seems excessive the dress is a moogler that kim kardashian wore so maybe the price is meant to reflect that we are all used to having most items available for free so it's strange to see this change i don't think it's a bad change but i do think it could get out of hand and turn into a farming nightmare if not implemented properly if it's just a handful of items to work towards then it'll be fine enough anyways that's my brief thoughts on this update let's actually try out this item properly by that i mean not on a smurf oh it just had to be this theme didn't it 1920s roaring 20s Bruh. Okay, we're gonna go for the costumey sort of one for this. This has got like tassels and stuff on. So it has two toggles, right? For two colors. You can do this like strange like shading thing on it. That's a question. How do patterns sit on this thing? That's interesting. I might go with that. Some pearls. Actually gonna go with these, but remove the ribbon. I actually don't like the skirt on there. I'm gonna get rid of it. I think that looks a lot better. Ooh, we're definitely going for the costumey effect with this one. Okay, let's get some here before I run out of time. After our custom themes video, I feel like the devs added this theme to the game. What about this one? I feel like it needs to be longer. Maybe not that long though. Okay, that is a better skirt to wear with this. I still need a hat though. Maybe this one would work this time. Quickly, I need a color 
color. It's probably gonna have to be gray. Okay, that works. I, I'm, I'm happy with that if that has to be my outfit. It's kind of a mess, to be honest, but it will do. It's not the best theme to try this dress out because I'm forcing a dress that doesn't fit the vibe of the 20s to fit into this theme. You see, I feel like this dress could be used in like a Marilyn dress because there is that Marilyn dress that's kind of similar. I think this one gets the vibe really well. People are adding like these peplums to the dresses and that doesn't make it 20s. 20s dresses are very like straight boxy dresses and skirts, right? You don't need peplums and all these extra like details to the dress because they didn't have them. This is... <laughs> I'll give it a two because it at least has got some kind of retro thing to it. That's 50s. Help. Someone needs to send help for these dress to impress players because they just don't understand the things. <laughs> I won because of course I did. Like not to toot my own horn. Honestly, the girl next to me was probably the only other one that, that got a, an outfit that was 20s vibes. <laughs> what is the next theme? I feel like we should try another one at least. Maybe not that one. Maybe not that thing. The theme is shopping, which isn't perfect, but you know what? I'm so tired of looking for servers with decent themes for this. Why do I like the look of that? Hang on a minute. I kind of like this. Oh, okay. I, I can make this work. I can make it a slightly more casual. Okay, this is broken quite late. If you put on the phone with the shopping bags, it does fix it slightly. Okay, shoes. I think I'm going to go with these in white. What about the beret? It's kind of nice. Do we need a necklace? Let's put this one on. I think this is ending up as denim and diamonds, to be honest. I actually really like how this dress looks. Even with this skirt on, you get some of the diamonds coming through in the bottom. Not the Sephora bags. Kind of makes it look like leather, to be honest. Like one of those excessively huge 2010 bags. They were just absolutely humongous. I used to have one for school. <laughs> they were just so huge you could use it to carry around your books and things. It's so funny that like the trend now is like really tiny bags. But in the 2010s it was just absolutely huge, excessively massive bags. <laughs> like there was no need. <laughs> win sephora bad girlies won what did i whoa and i didn't even vote for anyone nobody voted 17 i thought this outfit was at least a little bit good i still think it's cute cover of vogue a good one okay i'm gonna have to settle for this because i've used like half of my time i don't know about this but we're gonna we're gonna keep going <laughs> i'm gonna go for the bow shoes actually I think the choker would be pretty good for this one. Running out of time. I need like a hair accessory or something, I think. I'm not even that sure on this bag, to be honest. Okay, that's a lot cuter. I love how extra this is. That is so much denim. Cute, but simple. But then again, there's a lot of minimalism in like Vogue stuff. Common thing back then. Why did I give that a three? It's the most like chaotic outfit I've ever seen. <laughs> that was a misclick. I didn't mean to do that. Here's me then. See, that is minimalism, but that's really nice. That is definitely something you would see in an editorial. Oof. I got fourth though, actually. These votes are so low. At least you get the tickets for the placings instead of how many stars you get. But even then, look how close I am to 9,000. This one's interesting. Mermaid Siren. In fact, let's go for like this kind of blue. <laughs> Why do I look like Squidward tentacles? <laughs> go for that and then we'll put the white on there oh i'm loving this i'm loving this oh okay siren is so we get a nice little ombre there yes perfect let's go for that i'm really liking this so far that's really cool okay i'm gonna add longer sleeves to this oh that is so good if you want longer sleeves you can just put those on i don't know about that tiara that is really pretty though okay and that because it's got stars on it they look like little sea stars in what world is that a mermaid Okay, at least this one is on theme. <laughs> Can we get Mermaid Tails devs? That would be cool. For people who aren't VIP, there's like no items they can use to make this a mermaid siren theme because the siren ears are all in the VIP section. The long fishtail dress, the longer dress is in that section. Oh, okay, finally, someone to rival my outfit. Okay, we'll give them five stars for that. Okay, here's a little moon. Okay, yeah, you can use those, those trousers, okay. Came third. I voted really high for those two players, so that probably contributed to why they won. We all came joint. We we got the same. <laughs> we all came joint first. This dress 
definitely is versatile as you can see from the outfits I've made today. I do think it's worth the purchase but it's just going to take you a while to farm for it. While I was farming for this video I actually discovered a lot of pro servers and VIP servers had organized like custom themes and so many servers had come together to do loads of rounds with custom themes. It was so much fun. I don't know if I inspired that maybe <clears throat> but I really want to do another one of those videos videos so if you have suggestions I'm going to have a community tab post up where you can post all of your ideas for custom themes for the game there is so many themes in the game now so it might be a struggle to find ones that don't exist but I'm sure you will be able to come up with some so make sure you post it on the community tab not in the comments because it's easier for me to read and see them all over there so do that if you would like I don't know if you noticed but last month or through March, I tested out an upload schedule of Wednesdays and Saturdays. But I got a little burned out doing that because keeping to a strict schedule is a little stressful. So I'm going to be a little more relaxed with it. I didn't officially announce the schedule or anything because I just wanted to try it. But I am definitely going to be less strict about that upload schedule. It will definitely be an upload time of like Wednesday to Sunday. Whether you get one or two videos a week will really depend on how I'm feeling and such. Yeah, look out in your inbox Wednesdays to Sundays at 6pm. I may have a video on one of those days. And I think this way I can work on a better quality of video too because I feel like I'm just uploading things for the sake of uploading them instead of actually making really well-made quality videos for you to enjoy. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna see you whenever I next upload. Hopefully it's gonna be Astro Renaissance, I think, because I have a really good idea for a video for that. So. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Oh no, where is the wave animation? Oh no, where is it? Kawaii wave, I found it. Oh. Okay, goodbye.